bombing these guys. He's photo bombing these people. Last years, oh my God, this guy does it all. <laughs> All right, game two of the doubleheader. It'll be Tyler Anderson for the Dodgers. Daniel Norris will be pitching for the Cubbies. He is no relation, as far as I know, to Chuck Norris, unfortunately. Uh, if he was, maybe the Cubbies would have a chance in this one. My buddy Gabriel is gonna be joining me this evening. Gabriel, what is the prediction for the game tonight? It is gonna be six to two. Dodgers. Six to one Dodgers, unfortunately. I think you guys are taking it. Hey, Robert is here too. Robert, I was just telling Gabriel that uh, uh, Norris is pitching for the Cubbies tonight. He's in no relation at all to Chuck Norris, unfortunately. I was kind of hoping so. Maybe the Cubbies would have a chance tonight. Uh, yeah, no. Cubs have no chance tonight because no. he's no relation to Chuck Norris. No. Into the barrel room we go. That's where we're sitting this evening. Underground like... Uh, Ooh, like nightclub, Andrew. Like a speakeasy. Yeah. yeah, this is exciting. We got like a, we got like a commemorative um, bracelet. And uh, so this is pretty cool in here. Hey, Dustin. Hey. Boy, I can't Fireball. believe I ran into you here. I mean, Fireball. Wow. How you doing? Good. How are you, buddy? Good to see you. But what? You too. You too. Yeah. What do you think of this place? This is pretty yeah, nice, yeah. right? Swanky, like a speakeasy style. Yeah, kind it's of like place. a like an underground nightclub, yeah. like somewhere we're not supposed to be, or you need like a secret <laughs> password, and yeah. So in that bar-like area, where you actually can watch the players warm up uh, in the batting cage. So there's a two-way mirror where you can see in, but apparently the players can't see out. Well, Cody Bellinger was warming up. He was hitting in there, and so he comes out of the cage, and he looks at the two-way mirror, and he instructs the... Uh, the clubhouse uh, attendant to close the curtain. Door. So we couldn't see anymore, but we came back out to our seats. So guys, look at these seats right here. These are pretty sweet right here, I would say. Um, you are basically as close to the field as possible. Look over here. That's the Dodger dugout right there. So Clark is having some fun at the expense of Chris Taylor here. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes, a little mocking is going on. A little gamesmanship. Andy made a astute observation that this looks, this jersey looks very itchy. It, it, uh, it is itchy in very various places. It's kind of, uh, Look at this thing, jeez. Sandy though, come on. It's, it's worth the itchiness. Sandy paper. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be back. Yeah. I gotta use the little boys' room. Alright. Oh. Don't ever use that reference again. I'm gonna use the big boys' room. <laughs> There's Tyler Anderson, tonight's starting pitcher, and that's Mark Pryor. He was a Cub for a long time, had some arm problems. He's a pitching coach now for the Dodgers. There he goes. There's Laz Diaz, the famous umpire. He's a. Uh, He's talking to the uh, Dodger first base coach, telling him, don't give me any crap tonight, man, or there'll be trouble. Remembering up. Did they challenge or not? All right, no challenge. one nothing Cubs. You mean the Cubs got a first inning run. What's your prediction for the game? I never did get it. Uh, I said 8-7 Cubs. They're going to walk it off in the night. Christy, a prediction? Uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Just, just throw a prediction out there. I'm going to say the Cubs are going to win. Oh. The Mariners Robert, are going to win. you have anything to add? Yeah, 11 to 9, Dodgers. Davis is loaded walk, and the game is tied. This gentleman down here is offering Laz Diaz a cookie, but he refused. No, no. No eating while working, Andrew, right? No cookies. Nope. Wilson Contreras, a solo home run. 4-2 Dodgers. Yeah! Oh, Laz is showing some love to our guys down here. You're the man, Laz! You're the man! Andrew is uh, Laz Diaz. He is, is he the nicest umpire in Major League Baseball? Hands down. Is he better than my buddy Angel Hernandez? Uh, you're pushing it there. I don't know. He's a good, he's a good guy. I love Angel. I mean, he's a, he's a good, honorable 
man. Total bombing these guys. He's total bombing these people. Last years, oh my god, this guy does it all. <laughs> Yes. Oh my god, this guy's unbelievable. <laughs> that was a great photo. Better than Angel Hernandez. Yes, he is. Blue Star Gratterall is in the pitch for the Dodgers. Uh, Matt has just informed me that his firstborn child, he's going to name him Bruzdar after this man because he absolutely loves Bruzdar Gratterall. Yeah, first and second. Both. Jeffrey's been getting a lot of ladies' numbers on no, it. No, no. I'm, Jeffrey, I'm, congratulations. What do we got? Come on. Come Don't on. be ashamed. Uh, yeah, I, I, I've been a witness He's to He's turning bright red, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, no, I'm oh, not I'm batting like 300, on, which is right. not bad. Jeffrey, it's not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Nice. Let's be honest. <laughs> Robert has returned. He's like the Loch Ness monster. He just goes away and he just goes away and then suddenly comes back. Yeah. Where'd you go? Yeah, I just uh, had some urgent business. I had a business meeting up on the uh, third deck. Yeah. Oh, really? I think he was actually cold, ladies and gentlemen. He just he went down in the suite. I don't blame him. It's very cold. It's like 39 degrees out here. all we needed. You needed three hits. Mookie Betts did all the damage this evening. Five RBIs. Yep. Literally walking out of the gates of Wrigley Field right now after that 4-2 to two Dodger win. And uh, thank you. Good night. Yeah, 6-2. to two. My fault. And uh, we are walking across the street and this is where we're staying. Amazing. That was a very long walk, Robert. That is nuts. That is insane that that's the exit. That's that is the exit, exit of the field. And, 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 and that's our door. Right is where we're staying, right yeah. there where that guy's on the phone. He, he needs to move immediately. <laughs> we have the code. I mean, we're not trying to break into this place, but. Uh. <laughs> okay, so there's the gate, and here we go. I'll try not to trip up these steps, but I'll make no promises. You know? We were just in. Andrew's doing his vlog as well. And, uh, he's excited. The, here's the view. Look at this. There was where we exited, right there. <laughs> this place is pretty awesome. I believe these are the Dodger buses. The players will um, enter these buses. There's two of, two large champion coach buses. Now we don't uh, have access to the rooftops here to go see a game, but I, I assume these elevators go up to the top. Not really sure, but uh, I think that part of the building is locked off. But uh, that's where you go, apparently.